Good morning, Patriots. Welcome to RPTV. I'm Miguel Fernandez. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today's Friday, October 11, 2019. Let's go to KE to see what happened today in history. Thank you, Miguel. Today in history, on October 11, 1968, Apollo 7 was the first mission in the United States Apollo program to carry a crew into space. Let's go to DeAndre to see what's for lunch. Thank you, Katie. Today for lunch we have Italian chicken parmesan, cheeseburger, crunchy celery sticks, diced carrots, fresh banana, and your choice of milk. Bon appetit. Now back to Miguel. Thank you, DeAndre. That sounds delicious. Patriot, this week we have been celebrating our school spirit week, and it has been amazing. Today is Fun Patriot Friday. One dollar dress down ticket is required each day. We can't wait to see you show us your school spirit. In school news, tomorrow, October 12th, we will be participating in the 5th Annual 7K Breast Cancer Walk. Check-in is at 7 a.m. at Renaissance Charter School at Cooper City. This year's Fall Festival, or Trunk or Treat, will be on October 26th. Deadline to purchase these pre-sale tickets will be on October 18th for $4. We're having an October Scary Writing Contest. Everyone is welcome to participate for grades 6 through 8. Scary tours are due on October 31 with your ELA teachers. Please ask your teachers for the pre-sale purchase form. We look forward to seeing everyone come out to these great events. Now, let's go to Let's Talk with Jariah. Thank you, Miguel. Welcome to Let's Talk. My name is Jariah, and today we have with us Miss Merkel. Some of you may know her as Mrs. Anna. Um, she's recovering from a cold, so please be mindful of her voice, and thank you again for joining us on the Let's Talk show. Thank you. So congratulations, Mrs. Anna, on winning Teacher of the Month for um, October. And uh, I just want to ask you a few questions here. How did it feel when your name was called? Um, it was a complete surprise. I think there's so many other teachers that deserve this award. Mm -hmm. But um, I'm very thankful, and uh, I really, really appreciate it. It's, it's an honor. Mm -hmm. uh, what do you think made you stand out? Uh, they mentioned the scores that my students have had in the past with the EOC and the FSA. Uh, I personally think that uh, the fact that I, I adore my students, I, I try to be there for them uh, on, on a personal level and as a teacher, just like I do for my kids at home, and, and I care about their success and, and their well-being. Uh, what's something you look forward to? Um, I'm looking forward to this summer because my son will come back from college and hopefully we'll go see my family in the Canary Islands. And, and it's a little bittersweet because then my students will graduate and, and I won't see them. Hopefully they'll come back to visit. But at the same time, I'm so proud of them and I look forward to seeing them succeed and be happy and go and start a new phase in their, li in their lives. All right, so now we're going to the lightning round. Uh, what's your favorite number? Eight. Toy Story or Aladdin? Aladdin. Favorite sport? Soccer. Pizza or pasta? Pasta. Coke or Pepsi? Coke. Hamster or a fish? Fish. Okay, uh, that concludes our lightning round. Thank you, Miss Anna, for taking the time to sit down with us. We truly appreciate you and all you do. And um, scholars, help us congratulate Miss Anna when you see her in the hallways. And now back to Miguel. Thank you. Thank you, Jariah. Now, let's go to weather with Ernst. Thank you, Miguel. Today's weather in Pembroke Pines, Florida is forecasted to be 86 degrees Fahrenheit in scattered thunderstorm. Don't forget your rain gear. Now let's go back to Miguel. Thank you, Ernst. Now, for today's Hispanic trivia, where is Mr. Bardoni originally from? Teachers, please send your class answers to Ms. Cuadrado. Now, let's go to Angelica for a sports update. Thank you, Miguel. If you haven't heard, our boys' flag football team defeated Sheridan Hills 39-14 to make it to the playoffs. Big-time plays were made by 8th grader John Michael Morales, who stepped in to play quarterback, and 6th grader Jaden Lamar, who caught three touchdown catches 
and two extra points. Please help us congratulate the team in the hallway when you see them. Now back to Miguel. Thank you, Angelica. Patriots, don't forget your Pats expectations. It represents present yourself positively, act kindly toward others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a fantastic Friday. And remember, reset your mindset. Have a great day. Why are you bullying me? Uh, I tried to make a blooper. Did not work. I'm the invisible man. I'm the invisible man. Incredible how you can. See right through me.